Hey, what's up YouTube? It's your girl V from Be About Town and today we are back because I want to share a new in handbag with you all. Yes, another handbag. This time it's from McQueen. Without further ado, we're going to jump down to business because what you know, I don't believe in wasting anyone's time. <laughs> Okay, so we're going to get through this video. I'm going to share this handbag from a queen. I'm so excited about it. And we're not going to be rambling. We're not rambling this video, okay? Especially because the light is out and we need to, you know, use the daylight. You know what I mean? You know, come through daylight. Anyhow, the bag, like I said, is from a queen. And... Uh, I don't know. Can you guess what type of bag this is? Can you see this? Get into her. Oh my God. This is the best part. It's a crossbody, but naturally you can do it. It's a crossbody. But naturally, you can do it clutch style. Absolutely love this bag. I had to move you in closer so you can see in detail the type of bag this is. Obviously, I just finished saying Alexander McQueen. You can see that for yourself. It is the four ring. I mean, it is the four ring embellished crossbody bag. You can wear it as a clutch because you can take off the crossbody strap. But I actually quite like it. And I got it with, can you believe it, silver detail. Now, if you've been here before, you know I am a gold girl. But I do have one or two handbags with silver hardware. One of my handbags that I absolutely love is by Brandon Blackwood. And so I, I deliberated on getting this bag for a while and I kept going back and forth. And I'm like, girl, you do not have a lot of bags with silver hardware. And I just feel like it complements the red color very, very well. Now I will say initially when I purchased the bag, I wanted it to be a perfect match for my red ankle boots, but this is more of a, uh, it's a red, but it's not a tomato red or a Mac red. It is more like a Zamor type red, um, a raspberry red, if you will. Uh, but on the site, it looked like it was like that red, that like I said, like a MAC red, like that MAC red lipstick or Ruby Woo, like for those of you that don't, you know, that go for the Ruby Woo and <laughs> the MAC red. I absolutely love the MAC red. Anyway, that's not the point. This is the bag. Let me give you a close up of what it looks like. Uh, I purchased it from, just so you know, in case you're interested, from Setire and... Of course, you know, Setaya has wonderful prices. Typically, I know I'm a Ukes girl, but I go back and forth sometime. I get quite a few items from Setaya also. I don't know if you guys give a damn. I know, I kind of feel like once you've seen one dust bag and, you know, handbag, care, literature, you've seen it all, right? You know, if you're familiar with uh, McQueen, this is the type of hand hand dust bag or handbag dust bag or dust bag that comes with your handbag uh that they send very nice i will say it's nice quality dust bag i really love that you know they their dust bags have like that signature red to it but you can tell for you know reference this is the red i was expecting but it's a little more demure um de demure than the red that I, you know, a softer red, if you will. But I'm just like, what? What? Absolutely love 
absolutely love. And so one of the things I love, because I'm going to be all over the place, so I'm not going to be here forever because I just know. I said no rambling. Um, I love that I'll be able to, because it is such a soft red, you know, not a in your face red, I can absolutely really play around. I think you would do it with a bright red also. So let me not say that, but I want to really play around with the pink and red combination. Um, and I think this bag will allow me to do that. Anyway, on with the show. Very similar in size to my black uh, Skull McQueen bag with the black matte hardware. Uh, the the crossbody strap on that bag, though, is not leather and metal. It's just that black matte metal. Absolutely love, but it's not. This style just has one singular uh, skull in the middle, but I absolutely love. <sighs> absolutely love this bag. I, and I just love McQueen, period, period. But this bag, like... Look at, like, get into this. Now, right now, I don't have the strap adjusted, but of course, it does adjust in case you want to make it bigger. And I will have to make it bigger because, you know, if I plan on wearing it like a crossbody bag, why is this? Okay. <laughs> Just like, what's going on? Um, it can absolutely extend so that you can do that. I don't feel like forcing this right now. Hey, I figured it out. I figured it out. Oh, I figured it out. Cause I was just like, mm, mm, trying to do it gingerly and girl. But yeah, now, now you get the gist, right? Anyhow, because I'm just like, at, at, for a moment there, I was saying like, girl, does it? extend like what's going on but i just didn't want to force it because i mean obviously i don't have to explain that right but this is the bag so do it as a clutch as i said because this is removable i can do it as a crossbody which i suspect that's going to be what i do um but i do love i just absolutely love this bag She's a beauty. She's an absolute beauty. Girl, let me just look at you, girl. And there's just something about the skulls. I'm going to find me a skull brooch. I can find it on Amazon uh, because I have another skull brooch in like that black, like shiny black, but they also have it in silver, but I want to get a nice like silver one to match. Um, this, if I can, closely as possible, so I can put it on my jacket. Just for a little tassel, tassel. But I absolutely love this bag. Okay, let's get into the specs. Okay, so let's get into the specs because your girl did her homework. The bag is 9.5 centimeters in height. 17.5 in width and four centimeters in depth. I do want to do a comparison to my black bag so you can see, uh, you know, just for reference. And also because I carried that bag today, you'll see what fits in the bag. All right, so let's do that. This bag is a little wider than this bag. So I think I'm gonna be able to fit Maybe a lot. Oh, actually. Okay. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait a minute. Hold on. Wait a minute. Give me a second. Girl, why I forgot. <laughs> why I forgot I was recording and started playing with the bag. Anyway, these bags are not the same size. This one is a little wider. This one is a little taller in height. Let me put them back to back because that's the only way to truly compare them. I thought they were the same exact size because this is a mini also. This one is also, the black one is a smidge wider. 
Hmm. Let's see if these items can fit because this is the bag I carry today. I have my card case, which is also McQueen. I wore this thing down to the ground, but it's still in really great condition, as you can see. Like, it's, you know, it's holding strong. I have several lipsticks, child. Why? Two chapsticks, eyebrow pencils. Girl, for what? AirPods. <laughs> Another lipstick. You know why? Because I had these lipsticks in my bag over the weekend. I never took them out. And then I have a comb because I, I need this. My hair flies everywhere. And there's also a difference. This one in the back of the bag has the McQueen stamp, like um, impressed, embossed into the bag. Uh... It's like this with the same like pocket on the inside, very similar pocket, but this bag doesn't have the embossing on the back. It does have it here. It has it in the front. Well, I don't know, does this, this bag have it in the front? No. <laughs> yeah, this bag doesn't have it in the front, but this bag has it underneath the hood or the flap, if you will. And then the same pocket uh, that are in these mini crossbody McQueen bags. But let's see if these items will fit just the same because typically this is what I would be. Oh, actually, I don't know what I did with my keys, but my keys fit perfectly fine into this bag. What did I do with my keys? All right, so my comb fits. Um, let me see. I'm just going to put my card case in there. I'm going to, for, you know, for the sake of seeing what fits, I'm going to put my ear pods in there, a lipstick, a chapstick, because my lips are always dry. And then I'm going to find my keys and I'm going to see if they fit. Where are my keys? Lord. Oh. Here are my keys. Let's see if they fit. Oh, wrong bag. Let's see if they fit without issue. I hope so because this is exactly. Oh, yep. Uh, yep, 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 yep. Because I guess this bag is wider, so it is going to fit. All right, let me move some stuff around so we can get a true. Okay. I do have space enough for something else if I needed it, um, but not major, right? So for the most part, this is it. My keys, a lipstick. Um, oh, I never took off the, the plastic there, but I haven't worn the bag yet, so that makes sense. And it closes just fine. So as you can see, you fit a nice amount of things in this. It's not like a big bag. You can fit a planner, a wallet, a you know, a long wallet, all those things. But I have stopped carrying large wallets um, over a year ago. I've been carrying the same, which is a crime because I purchased quite a few card cases. So, girl, yeah, and I have like three wallets. I just stopped carrying big wallets because I just did. Um, this just fits my lifestyle a little bit more. But I think I might be switching my card case. Uh, just to give this one a break because I do really, really like it and I don't want it to be worn down to the ground. Uh, but she, she's, she's holding up pretty nicely, even though I am like squeezing her to capacity. I think squeezing her a little too much because you see my bank card is kind of like peeling. <laughs> um, so, you know, but yeah, this fits pretty much everything. As you can see, like you can see like my cards and stuff there, um, ID and such. But yeah, this bag fits quite a few things in case you're interested. And I would say, I would truly advise, oh my gosh, it's pretty. Mm. She's so pretty. Girl, how'd you get here? Mm. And who'd you come here with? <laughs> Okay, anyway, I'm being stupid, but this is my McQueen bag. Absolutely love this bag. So I'm glad that I got this in this color. 
And then, you know, I like wearing my rock from time to time. You know, yeah, just to remember how well Mr. Williams did. So, um, this is perfect for that. I think this is going to, you know, fit nicely into my wardrobe. I can't wait to start. Actually, I can do this with camel. I mean, look at what I have on. This is perfect. You know, obviously everybody knows that leopard and cheetah print, cheetah print and leopard print neutrals, but this looks perfect with this. And I just purchased from the Mingo outlet, considering sending the bag, child, but I'm not. I'm going to keep it because I feel like the way I want to style it, I have these red slacks that Oscar from Mingo outlet and this uh, leopard print. Is it leopard print? Child is one of those uh, blazers, but the problem. Anyway, I'm rambling. We're going to end this video because I'm going to go on a tangent. Otherwise, thank you so much. You guys have better things to do than to hear me go on my tangent. Thank you so much for stopping by. I truly appreciate you guys for coming back every single week, especially because you can, you know, be wherever. You don't have to come hang out with your girl. So I do truly appreciate you guys so much. I can't articulate how much, but I truly do. Thank you so much for stopping in. Please remember to like, share, and consider subscribing if you have not subscribed already. Leave me a comment down in the comment box. Let me know what you think of my new bag. Again, I got it from Satire. You know we love Satire around here. Also, you know my number one boo is Ukes, but we do love Satire because she does get the girls together on a budget and we love, we love, we love conserving coin over here. So check, I'm gonna link it in case you're interested. They have a num girl, real quick. They have a Bordeaux and the quilted McQueen knuckle bag, gold hardware. It took everything. It took everything in me not to get that one instead. But I have like at least two. I mean, but how, th actually three, four. Girl, you don't need any more Bordeaux Merlot bags, but it's so pretty. I don't know. Will I be able to contain myself? We will see, but I don't need any more. Anyway, I'm going to log off now because, yeah, thank you so much again for stopping by. <laughs> again, please remember to like, share, leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you think about my bag. And until next time, as always, take great care. Bye. <laughs>